off limits. Bush, rot.
up in the fodder. my friend. Soon we'll be hunting. Beerston, Estrid said you'd be here. Eivor, dear heart, you who drew back the bow of Eros and reunited me with my one true love. Have your thanes asked why you do not look for Estrid? Pish. They have asked, yes. I said it was hopeless. Then I lay upon my couch, sobbing and wailing. A pretty show. That may not be enough. Tut tut. The wind is soft upon our faces, and I am far from the whispering doors of Colchester. Come, let's hunt! What are we hunting now? Boar! A majestic animal, don't you think? Driven by a fierce fire, blazing eyes, and sword tusks. I once knew a strong-armed shield maiden who rode a boar into battle. She named it Bristlebold. How wondrously strange! Your tales are worthy of the hearing. We'll not ride our boars, but eat them. A feast in Alvida's honor. A feast for your mistress? Biston, if this ruse falls apart, King Alfred will strip you of your title. Our alliance would be worthless. Have no fear, I shall be discreet. We will eat and sup at my hall with a few friends and family. It is there our friendship will be sealed. So soon after Lammas, will people there not recognize me? No, you are just one more Dane. And in that chaos, who remembers anything but the screams of dear Estrid? These are your lands, I trust in your judgment. And how is Olvida? She is a firebrand. We have rekindled our love as if we were teenagers. Even Ellerich is a welcome addition. A younger brother to me, yet more alike to a son. The things I should like to teach him. Ah, this is the spot. The best boar here. This table won't fill itself. They are fearsome beasts, but tasty. This table won't fill itself.
We did well, Eivor. A good hunt, Beston. And enough for one day, I think. Even my thanes will not go hungry with this catch, and they are as voracious as wolves snatching at my carcass. They may give you grief, but I've been nothing but amused. They are a welcome change to warring yarls and piss-sudden politics. You have brought us all true happiness, Eivor. I thank you from the bottom of a heart full up with joy. Beeston, the heart hound, who sought his true love by searching the sad haven of his memory and finding her there. Beautifully said, my friend. Beautifully said. Come, Percy, you hapless hound. Barely a boar worried. I do not know why I keep you in my employ. Just raise my hood here. this. Home and hearth never used to stir the soul as the hunt did. But now my Alvider is here. All is changed. Oh, Bearston. You promised we would never be apart. Not for one waking or sleeping moment. And already you're sneaking out to hunt. Ha ha ha! For the feast, sweetling. We owe our mutual friend a great debt. One that I promised to repay over suckling pig and ale. Sister, have you forgotten where you are? I have a right to happiness, Elreach. Or am I to play nursemaid forever, you ungrateful pup? Happiness, yes. But you embarrass yourself nightly, heaving and sweating with this hamhock. Hold your tongue, boy. Lest we both speak our truths. What truth have you to speak? That you've returned to this fickle man who abandoned you years ago for a Frankish pet? A woman he paid this dame to abduct in that lamish shadow play. Mind yourself, boy. 
or that you let him sniff and paw you and take him to your bed on the promise of nothing? The whole of Essex whispers now. He's married still, his wife freshly stolen, and you are no more than... than his... I am the mother of his child, you whelp! Child? Alvida? Please, my boy, I... I... I will never forgive you for this. Never! <laughs> my lord, joyous news! God smiles upon us this very day! Estrid has been found by Alfred's men. They ride to her rescue as we speak. I will not let this plot be undone. Nothing is safe till they are away to Frankia. I will fix this, and one day I will call on you, and you will come. You can count on it, my friend. I wanted to tell you so many times. Hush, Angel. Do not fret so. He hates me. What have I done? We must go after him. He will not stray far, Lamb. Much has been said this day, but if... If he is my son, our son, we must believe he will return to us. Are you leering at me, Lord? Your Beerstons hide Dane. Do not think what you did went unseen. Yet tell me one thing. Is Estrid safe and happy? She's happy. That much I know. Good. Now leave. And if we meet again, you will fall by my sword. Oh. <sighs> Estrid should have ruled this land. I would have followed her anywhere. you Definitely not good.
Need to cloak myself here. Need your eyes, my friend. Stretch your wings, Sunan.
Christ is surely with us. <laughs> 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 Best raise my hood here. What surprises await me this time? This looks like an old cellar. The air reeks of stale wine. Are those barrels still full? The wine has filled the shaft bearing my prize with it. I should be able to reach it now. A shaft. I can see something at the bottom, but it's out of my reach. A drinking horn. It looks valuable. A good find, I think. Huh?
Estrid is so close to freedom. I hope I'm not too late. Rolo! Alfred's men have found you! What? How can this be? Lork, stand by Estrid. Guard her with your life. If she's taken, all is lost for us in Birsten. Come, lady. It would not do for them to take you back. Watch out! Lark! Odin, no! Release the woman, Danes! If she's unharmed, we may let some of you live! What Here come the go? bastards! No! Protect Astrid! Right. Prepare the ship! What's happening? Lord God, back! Estrid, I promised I would free you of your life in Wessex. Frank here awaits your return. Go now, with Aegir's blessing. I will miss you, Eivor. When winter is past, summer will come and wind you in a flowered skirt. For you are beauty, and shall not wither. Goddess Freya, give me more of that. Come, take care of her, Rollo Stoutheart. And if you find yourself on England's shores again, I will expect you in my hall. Good. They are safe. Birsten got his end of the bargain, and Estrid is to Frank here. I should return to Rantvi.
Best not to draw attention here. That's enough! We have this! Yes, yes, one more, and only because you all have such good taste. Now, this one. This one begins. Quat tidem de Eivor. In Essex, I played a matchmaker and a heartbreaker. An easy way to forge an alliance, but... Let us stick to war and diplomacy. Understood. Thank you, Eivor. <laughs> 